Welcome to Extra Extra, presented by VDG Sports. I am your host, Vince Douglas Gregory. No filter, very censor. You can follow Extra Extra on Twitter at Extra Extra VDG. Be sure to check out the, the website, vdgsports.com. There's a YouTube as well. YouTube as well. Like, subscribe, and share. I think that's what they do there. And if you want to keep up with me and my whereabouts, said it long enough. Now I'm going back to not saying it again. Let the hunt begin. Now that that is all out of the way, now that all of that is gone, let me just go ahead and say, noobs, thank you for giving me an opportunity. Thank you for giving me a chance. Thank you for giving me a shot. Whether I hit or miss, it's up to you. But know this, it's not going to keep me up at night. That is not going to keep me up at night. Trust me, there are more things that keep me up at night. And I'll just leave it at that. Regs, we back at it again. We are back at it again. You know how we do. Let me pull this curtain back. Let me pull the curtain back just a little. Get a look-see. And this is for the noobs, because Regs, you already know, this is for the noobs and everybody else in between. My happy place, or the thing that brings me the most joy. Wait a minute. The thing or one of the many things that bring me joy and make me happy is baseball, period, full stop, baseball. It is my happy place. Baseball is just something about it that just makes me excited, that makes me happy. And I know what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking because I've had this convo with many, many people. They say it's boring, but that's that's fine. That's fine. I can accept that. I can accept that the sport is boring because we don't judge here. We don't judge here. And I will leave the judgment to the other people who have the receipts. I'll leave the judgment to the other people who have the receipts and ready to utilize those receipts. But me, I'm just going to keep this. 100 and i'm gonna keep this in my lane and my lane is baseball brings me joy baseball is my happy place baseball is the equivalent of me singing dancing and making my chest pop inside the g-rod it's what i like to do it's what i like to watch it is what i like to play when i'm able to play when i am able to play and there is definitely some uh, sentimental value behind it. There's definitely some uh, ties into family and friends that's behind it that just pretty much up the ante, that just increase my uh, love for the game. I know that may come off as a little bit strange and weird that I love baseball and baseball is my favorite sport yes i take shots yes i do because if i didn't i wouldn't care i would not care i would not want to be bothered with it at all i wouldn't want it in my world period unless i'm just jokey joking it up for some laughs and he he's and ha ha's and you know the rest that's not the case. That is not the case. Baseball is truly, truly something that I, that I can get behind, that I can stand up for or stand up with side by side, of course, side by side, of course. And a thing about baseball that I just enjoy there's so many different directions that I can focus on, that I can concentrate on, that I can just have my interest peak. This is coming from the fellow who says watching grass grow can be an interesting endeavor. 
watching grass grow can be something that I could do more than once without being forced to. That's a little bit behind the curtain. Now, you know. Hashtag the more you know. In baseball, it's it's not like it's a one size fit all. There's different things that you can focus on. There are different avenues that you can drive down. There's just so much about it. And people tell me constantly it's boring. There's so much things that's happening and going on that I can focus on, that I can basically give all my attention to. And it's not boring for me. It's not boring for me. And as I was saying previously, yeah, it's coming from the person who liked to watch grass grow or not like can watch gas grow, grass grow, not gas, but grass can leave out the R, cannot leave out the R. In baseball, it's definitely something that the entire family is involved with. Definitely something that the entire family watches to a certain extent. It's, it's more than just a game. It's more than just boring. It's, it's, it's a, it, it's a way for generations to share a common love of something and still be able to conversate on what's happening because there's not much that change with the game. And that's a double-edged sword for sure because the average age of the fan in baseball is pretty, 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 pretty old. That lets me, or that leads me to believe that me and a little bit under me, we, we, we've done a very, very bad job of promoting the sport or helping the sport grow now i i can't take all of the blame but i'll definitely take some of the blame i should i should have done more and i will probably try to do more to help highlight this beautiful beautiful sport this game that we just or I and we as in the fam and pretty much 80% of you, you pull, enjoy this. But, 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 but we ain't gonna be here forever. We aren't gonna be here forever. And if we aren't showing the nuance of baseball, if we aren't doing the things that basically brought us in to enjoying the sport that that gave us this unconditional almost unconditional love of the game if we aren't passing that down if we aren't basically just hey here you go here it is making it be known that the, the sport can be interesting now it's not all on us either it's not all on us we can take some of the blame but we ain't taking all of the blame in fact i'm gonna be generous and say we probably should take about five percent of the blame and the other 95 percent should go to mlb or baseball in general especially where i am located at doing a horrible bad job of promoting the sport then with blunder on top of blunders on top of blunders mishaps on top of mishaps on top of mishaps then you got cheating on top of cheating then you got idiots morons and I, I can keep going i can keep going you get the picture you get the point point. and baseball can't survive in the long 
turn in a long haul, going down the same path, doing the same things it did in the past, thinking that that would just be enough to bring in the new fanatic, to bring in the new fans, to bring in the new casual peeps who would actually give it a look-see or a try. You have to do more, MLB, Major League Baseball, or baseball in general. We can only do so much. We can only do so much to help the sport, to help in general. Baseball has to make itself more available to younger people. We don't have the funds for that. Now, now, if you don't care about baseball as much as I or we, then that's that's sad. That makes me sad and that takes me out of my happy place. And now I think I'm going to have to go somewhere to sing, dance, not in a G-Rod because I won't be making my chest pop. I'm too sad for that. Thank you, baseball. <laughs>